Hi, I'm Andrew Childress, and in this quick screencast, I'm going to show you how to stabilize videos in Adobe Premiere. When you're filming, it's ideal to use a mount or tripod to make sure your video stays steady. But sometimes, this just isn't possible, and you end up with shaky handheld video. It can be really disheartening to preview your prize footage, only to realize it isn't stable. And in any quality production, camera shake is a real deal breaker. It's all your audience will notice. But that doesn't mean we can't solve it. With Adobe Premiere, you can actually stabilize video clips that have camera shake. In just a few clicks, you can take a shaky and unusable clip and turn it into something that looks great. Let's learn how. I'm working in Premiere, and I have a blank project screen open. I have a short clip from the Storyblocks video library that I want to stabilize. It's already downloaded to my computer, so I'll click and drag it onto the timeline as you're seeing me do here. Premiere will import the video, and I can hit my spacebar to preview it. As you can see, the video itself looks great, but because it was shot handheld, it's a little shaky. What I want to do now is stabilize the video using one of Premiere's built-in tools. Up at the top here, I'll click on the Effects tab. You'll see this sidebar open on the right side. This is where I can select from the built-in effect library. I'm going to go ahead and click on the Video Effects folder on the sidebar, and then click to open the Distort subfolder. You'll see this list of effects here, and to stabilize a video, the one you want to choose is called Warp Stabilizer. To apply the Warp Stabilizer effect to my video, I'm going to click and drag on the effect name, and then drop it on top of my clip here in the timeline. A message will appear on the video, signaling that Premiere is analyzing the clip frame by frame. This process runs pretty fast, but of course will vary based on the length of your video. Once it's finished, Premiere will start processing, which means it's applying a stabilizing effect. That's it. As the processing finishes, I'll hit my spacebar again to preview the new video. As you can see, it looks much better. In just a few clicks, we've taken a shaky video and added stability to make it far more watchable and enjoyable. You can also try out a wide variety of third-party stabilizing plugins for Premiere. Although the built-in effect is great, some of these will offer more advanced options. Premium options like New Blue Stabilizer and Better Stabilizer offer professional grade features to expand your video horizons. I'm Andrew Childress for Storyblocks and thanks for learning with me.